Ladies and gentlemen, dear friends, uh, let me first of all, on behalf of uh, Fidil, uh, thank Sasha Bailey for her kind uh, words and uh, continue the thanks to George Santa and his boss, uh, René Vanka, who have been really been the anchor man here uh, in uh, putting to life and in developing this initiative in the initial uh, phase. Fidil has undergone a certain number of changes uh, this year and last year. Uh, in terms of its uh, focus when it comes to digitalization, uh, we have put in place uh, uh, what is called the Fedil Digital Board Group, which uh, I'm chairing in my capacity as Vice Chairman of uh, uh, Fedil. Uh, this uh, group will uh, guide Fedil's work in the future on digital transformation and uh, innovation. It will, or is in the course of defining its priorities and implementing these. Um, in the years uh, to uh, come. I don't want to highlight all of them, but I just want to mention three of them. Uh, E-government is very high up on uh, our agenda, in particular e-invoicing and the digitalization of uh, procedures on which we're working hand in hand uh, with the government, and we welcome each and every initi initiative in that uh, uh, context, and these initiatives are also at the heart of uh, innovation. Uh, cyber security is a very hot topic for us as well. We have put in place our cyber security uh, tool uh, kit. We're working further on that also in the context uh, of the European uh, initiatives on cyber security and Europe is really our third focus uh, here. Uh, to name only a few of the subjects, uh, I'm mentioning uh, 5G, artificial intelligence, e-privacy, and the uh, reforms on e-commerce, uh, where uh, on e-privacy uh, we uh, are a little bit concerned about the developments that are going uh, on at the European level, despite the fact that uh, the uh, initial text uh, have been put on, on hold and we're looking now uh, towards Brussels to see what is going to be uh, next. I believe personally, I'm saying this in my personal capacity and not as Vice Chairman of FIDIL, that uh, e-privacy doesn't add anything to the existing framework, it only, and if it adds something, it adds further uh, confusion. Uh, FIDIL has been launching uh, its uh, Digital for Industry initiative in 2016, uh, a platform to support industry, and part of it was and is the Luxembourg uh, digi Digital uh, Hub, the one-stop shop for industry when it comes to uh, digitization. Sasha has been uh, outlining the initial role uh, of uh, FIDIL. Today the project is hosted, managed by Lux Innovation. Uh, knowing Sasha, one could also say that Lux Innovation has taken over. We, we continue in the positive sense. It not, was not an unfriendly takeover, it was a totally friendly takeover. And we continue to be the biggest fan of Digital for Innovation. We continue to be its main supporter and we aim at being one of your major partners in the future as well, working hand in hand with you as well. I'm particularly happy also uh, to have uh, uh, SNT presenting uh, here today, of which I'm an affiliate uh, professor in a different capacity, as well as my friend Thomas Calstinius. Uh, <coughs> Uh, from list, I believe it is fundamental to bring industry and academia further uh, together. We have been working in various fora over the last years uh, uh, to, to, to accomplish this objective and I believe and I'm convinced that today's initiative is definitely one of those uh, which will be a game changer in that uh, uh, context in the interest of all the stakeholders and the interest of the Luxembourgish industry at uh, large. Thank you very much.